Yo, what's going on guys? Spartan here, and we're 18 minutes off of Modern Warfare 2's worldwide reveal. And I'm just saying, I'm super excited for this game. I can't wait. Yeah, I just woke up like 10 minutes ago, went to bed at 4am playing BO2 Plutonium with the boys. We were playing Mob of the Dead, and uh, yeah, I had to, I had to dip out because it was getting a little too late, and uh, you know... Gotta wake up for the Modern Warfare 2 reveal and see how it is. But I hope you guys enjoy and peace. I swear, man. If I don't join FaZe Clan off this game, you know what? You know what? Hold up. Hold up. Just to manifest this shit, right? Just to manifest this shit. Oh my god, I can't type. Right there. I'm joining FaZe Clan off this game. Fuck, where'd it go? <laughs> Holy shit, chat goes up by so fast. Here. I'm joining FaZe Clan off this game. FaZe fucking Spartan, baby. FaZe the fuck up. We're gonna fucking finally finish what we started this year. 60 seconds! Oh shit. Oh shit. Scope! Let's go! That's my future teammate! Come on! People are saying remove skill based matching. Already, huh? That's not gonna happen. Hopefully, it's way less strict. Cold War was not fun facing the same people every single day in 12v12, bro. You'd find the same people every single day. None, none of us got off. We we had no lives, bro, honestly. None of us got off that. <laughs> none of us got off that. Premiere will begin shortly. Please. Morbius better be an operator. Every, bro, I swear, everybody in the chat was saying, like, Mormon warfare, it's Mormon time, and shit like that. Oh, my God. Bro, come on. Give it to me! Give it to me! Yes! 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 Bro, this is really happening right now. Wow. A new era of Call of Duty. Time to enter a new era, boys. Come on. Ten. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, zero. Oh shit! Bro, campaign already looks OD. We got a hit on Hassan. We can't take him in Iran. He's not in Iran. Who do we send? I fucking love COD. <laughs> the GOATS! 141! Let's go! Okay, Soap looks way better than he did in Modern Warfare. Oh, I can't even lie. <laughs> Alright, last where we're in position. Bravo, Some more wetsuit off, missions? Yeah. I'm so down. This is capture or kill. <laughs> Boy or mission flashbacks, bro. Oh my god! And there's an old nice. How the hell did Iran get their hands on this? It's either Russia or us. Anywhere I roll. We need an army. 
Look, get it in the army. Mexican Special Forces, 141, they are your brothers now. Where I lay my head is thrown down. Weapons hard, vaqueros. October 28th cannot come Order soon now. enough. Get early access to the open beta. Please no PlayStation exclusivity. It didn't say PlayStation exclusivity. It didn't say PlayStation exclusivity. Oh my god. Please. Please. No, 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 no. Please tell me there's no PlayStation exclusivity. Please. Please. We do not need that. In 2022, bro, we do not need that. Oh my god. Yo. And the tr the trailer tomorrow is going to be hype. Because this is an actual gameplay trailer, bro. That's that's insane. Well, that was it for this part. I'll see you guys tomorrow when they drop the other trailer. So we have a full reaction. See ya tomorrow. Call of Duty time. Oh, it's Call of Duty time? Oh my god. That just happened. All right, moving on. This October, Those Call of Duty Modern yep, Warfare 2 time. arrives. Infinity Ward is once again returning to its roots for a modern day action game. And today we're about please, to see the world premiere of High damage fast snipers, please. To tell us more, please. The port of Long Beach to Can't do it anymore, man. Ferris, the head of Call of Duty. Vanguard was the last straw. I hope they learn from their mistakes. Modern Warfare changed everything. And on October 28th, for the worst era of Call of Duty with the launch too many campers two. we are back we are bigger and we are bringing the entire team price gas soap Alejandro and this of is course it. ghost I think we so the stage big enough to debut Call of Duty in a whole new way inspired by the world we're about to enter oil rigs cargo ships and staggering odds are just the beginning here is modern warfare 2. Bro, they went big with the marketing on this shit. I'm I'm still amazed that people are glossing over the fact they're calling this a magnum opus. Like, I th I don't think people understand the gravity of that. It looks so good. I think that's a vector. Yeah, but I was watching Butter's video. She said she saw vector gameplay, but that might have been multiplayer. Yeah. Bro, this looks so crazy. Oh my God. Severely upgraded isn't even like a word. Oh, it's a vector. Oh, hoo -hoo. the vector looks so nice. So cut right clear through. That's a nice noise. Room clear. Coming out. Recall on it's the same. Good. <laughs> Need some skill back back in <laughs> this game. Huh. Need some skill back. This literally looks like real life. This is fucking crazy. Ghost, we're moving to the main deck. What's your status? 
Boarding the ship with Shadow 3 now. Roger that. Holy shit. Oh, that flash. We need to move fast. All shadows, force out. I want eyes on that container now. Ooh, they're called the shadows. That's kind of sick. We got to roll. Shadow one, go. Visual on flares. Is that an ACR? Is that an ACR? They're signaling the ship. Hold up. I think that's an ACR. Bro, please. Intervention footage. Please. The flash, the new flash sound is insanely nice. Brother, suits being wet just looks so this real. That's fucking crazy. Have to stop the Everything sounds so oh my god, this game has to be like the most realistic COD we've ever had. Magnum Opus is right, bro. <gasps> you can mantle things that are big! Oh my god! <laughs> Cold War Mantle in Modern Warfare. Let's go. Got disassembled. Unlucky. They closed off the bridge entry. Secure the deck and we'll the door. Visual on bridge entry. Check it. Controls are internal. Alright, stand back. Shadow one. Nice. Explosive on bridge entry. 
Ghost got an R700. Apparently it's gonna be called the S something R. S C oh yeah, S C R instead of SPR. So it's gonna be like a sniper version. Pre-order now and get early access to the open beta. See how there's no notice how there's no PlayStation? First access on That's PlayStation? What we're talking about. And joining us now, I think there still is, though. Long Beach. Johanna, great to see you. I mean, they'd usually say it uh, great to at have the trailer. And also so. Jeff from, uh, Infinity. Of course, our new water tech, which is actually pushing the boat in different directions. It's creating a physically dynamic environment, allowing for the cover you were seeing. In certain cases, you could be behind cover, and then suddenly that cover would shift and leave you exposed. But it also leaves the enemy exposed, creating this emergent gameplay. Um, so Damn, bro, that's I'm, actually I'm very fascinating. Excited. Just can't wait that I'm so excited <laughs> that we get to show it off today. We're just so excited for October 28th. It's such a big moment, Dang. not just for Modern Warfare 2. It'll be um, a standalone experience of Warzone for current Thank existing um, players as well. So Thank God. we're going to sort of feed the entire community there. But we're in we're in position. We're really excited. All right. Well, we're looking forward to October. Thanks so much for giving us a first look at the gameplay Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2. Thanks, Johanna and Jeff. Uh yeah, I don't know. Um, I just think that, I mean, the gameplay, okay, it was fucking sick, but, like, we didn't see that much, you know? We didn't see that much. So, I don't know what to think. But, my God, does it look so sick. And that vector recoil is telling. Because, bro, yep. that, oh, dude. It's just a sign that skill gap is going to come back to the game. And I'm so happy, so happy for that. Oh my god. Wow. All I gotta say is wow. Could definitely be a magnum opus, as they say. Because it's looking like one. Um, if you watch any interviews from people, they said water is heavily involved in this game. And like the new water physics are fucking crazy. Which I mean, if you looked at the gameplay, you could see it. You know what? Guys, uh, I want to watch that 4K on COD. Well, uh, yeah, it's fire. Play... Yeah, seven minutes. Oh, wow, bro. That leak was accurate as fuck. Seven minutes, 40 seconds. Bro, this shit in 4K is nice. <laughs> it's so far. Legit just looks like Modern Warfare 2019. No, nah, Logic, you're capping. You're capping so hard. Do you know how graphically better this shit looks? Oh, my God. And the amount of mechanics so they added to this. Logic, trust me when I say this isn't the same game. Like, this is... This is Modern Warfare 2019, how it should have been. But they needed to fuck up on Modern Warfare 2019 to make Real this clear. game. Coming out. So, yeah, all work. Oh man, I wonder if that's an ACR. Like, that second gun that's so pads on this mission literally looks like an ACR. I swear. It's either an ACR or a new AR. Bro, that's gotta be an ACR. I hope the running is like that. I hope tax sprinting is like that in this game. If tax sprinting is exactly like that, that's gonna. Yeah, it looks like that's the tax sprint, and that's sick. Th no wonder why there's no sprint to fire in this game. Because the tax sprint's exactly like Halo's. <laughs> Which is good, because now when you tax sprint, your arm won't be in front of your face and you won't hit somebody's arm when you're trying to headshot them. It's true. That literally cost me my life in Warzone a couple times. Especially, like, off a win. When I quickscope somebody in the face, they're tax sprinting, I hit their fucking arm instead of their brain. Like... Oh. Where are the controls? On that damn ship. On that damn ship. Bro, look at how the water droplets are on the scope, bro. Oh, the attention to detail is so insane. Stop 
Even the facial animations are crazy. I wish we got to see go shoot that thing though. Like I was really hoping for some sniper gameplay, man. But unfortunately, no. Sniper gameplay would have been fun. There's at least one shot. Like, why couldn't you just pick up a sniper and just take like one shot? I know. Dude, I'm just so happy we can actually mantle shit in this game. No Fortnite fucking jump fatigue like Modern Warfare. <laughs> no little mantles, bro. Oh my god, I just realized we'll finally be able to climb rocks in Warzone, dude. Finally. I'm so glad he mantles, bro. That just gave me like 200 times more hope for this game. And seeing the vector recoil. Oh. Even while mounted it as recoil, yes! That's what we love to see! That's an M870. Yeah. That's an M870. So we got Vector, M870. ACR, probably? I think that was an ACR. Pre-order now and get early access to the open beta. Holy shit. I need it. I need it. Shit looks so realistic, bro. I could watch this for hours. <laughs> bro, this shit literally doesn't even look like a game. It looks like a Michael Bay movie. Like... <laughs> I also like re-watching trailers because you notice a lot of shit you don't notice within like the third or second watch. Okay, so from the signs that I've looked at this time, it looks like it's an American oil rig, not like Middle Eastern. So it's not Al, like Al Qatala is still the main bad guy in the game, but this isn't in the Middle East. Like I'm not seeing any other. We're moving to the main languages deck. on What's any of the status? signs, which there usually would be. Roger that. So it's it's American. In the trailer, Laswell says that Alcatala got the weapons from either the Russians or the U.S. So I'm thinking that Shadow Company is supplying Alcatala, and that's why they're in the game. They're the ones supplying them, because they're a private militarized company, and they can do whatever the fuck they want. So maybe they're working with Alcatala, and we're going to end up fighting them. That's, what I, that's where, where I think this is going. We know the Russians are fucking out of commission after Modern Warfare 2019. So it has to be Shadow Company supplying off the dollar in the campaign. Because this campaign is heavily focused on operating in the gray area, so I wouldn't be surprised if Shadow Company supplying out. And 141 and the Shadows are going to have to go after Shadow Company. Is that, or maybe Vargas is part of Shadow Company, but I don't think they are because their Mexican name is like it like translates to Shadows of the Dead or something. So I don't think they're part of Shadow Company, but maybe. We'll see. Because Vargas's team is Mexican Special Forces, so I don't think these guys are Shadow Company. Why can't we see Go shoot that? Oh, it's so disappointing. No sniper gameplay at all, man. That looks like a honey badger from Ghost, bro. That literally looks like a honey badger. Pre-order now and get early access to the open beta. I don't know. Oh shit, man. October 28th, though. That's so far! Why is it so far? 
Oh. It's so far. Here's the very first look at Modern Warfare 2 gameplay. Simply in trade point. I don't care. I just woke up probably 20 minutes ago. Uh, I just woke up probably 10 minutes ago, you know, went to bed uh, at 4 a.m. last night playing BO2 Platoon. Fuck!